Hey guys, I just thought I'd do a quick vlog for you addressing my braces. Never thought they would stir up enough interest, um, but a lot of you guys have been asking about them, and so I thought I would just fill you guys in. Um, as you can tell, I am a grease ball right now. It's kind of late into the night, but if you don't mind, I'm just going to go ahead and freshen up for you guys. Normally I would do this off camera before I get on camera, but hey, it's a vlog. Vlogs are a bit more raw. Why not just show you guys what I do to freshen up a little bit? So, everything's pretty self-explanatory. I'm not going to really be talking during this, but hope you enjoy the music that's playing. It's actually um, music from a friend of mine, Ken Liu. He also has a YouTube channel here, so feel free to check that out and check out his other work. He's very, very talented. So, alright. Let's get right to freshening up. Okay, I'm all set with freshening up. I just blotted my face a little bit because it was really, really greasy as you can tell and just a little bit of lip gloss. But anyways, on to my braces. A lot of you guys have been asking about them. I have to be honest with you guys. Um, it's kind of a secret. Well, okay, it's not a secret, but I'm ashamed to say that no one's perfect, right? You guys will forgive me. This is actually my second time wearing braces. And I'm sure a lot of you guys can probably guess why. Let's say the first time, I had to remove my braces kind of early because we had moved out of, you know, the state and moved kind of far away. 
and so I wasn't able to like transfer my plan and continue wearing the braces for longer. So I had my braces removed early this first time around and then I had to wear retainers pretty early and I just I wasn't consistent with wearing them and over time my teeth kind of shifted back and it's it sucks it's a bummer because teeth shifts so easily like you know even if you've had your braces for a long time it still has your teeth still has the ability to shift back so definitely wear your retainers guys um wear it all the time if you can definitely wear it at least every night so i've learned my lesson that's why i have my braces again i know it's kind of a bit yeah just don't, just don't do what I did. <laughs> but it's my second time having braces, and that's why I guess some of you are wondering, oh, why, are, you know, it might, you know, you might think I'm younger than I am, or why do I have braces at this age? The truth is, you're never too young or old to have braces. As long as you have enough teeth and all of your baby teeth have fallen out, you're, you know, you can have braces. So there's some people get braces when they're really young. Some get them when they're a lot older, and it's really... It's really not a big deal. So I guess, you know, I shouldn't be so shocked that a lot of you guys have been asking me about my braces because it's very, very common to get them, and it's good for you. So, um, a lot of you guys have been asking what kind of braces I have. I have the regular metal kinds, not the ceramic kinds or, like, the invisible kinds. I don't wear Invisalign. I've never tried that. Um, I believe these metal kinds are the most inexpensive, and so that's the kind I have. Um... As for the bands that I wear on them, when I was, you know, back in my earlier teenage years, I would all, I would wear, like, the all different kinds of colors and have fun with it. But now I'm kind of, you know, I kind of want to be more discreet with them. So I wear, like, the white cream colored bands. It's not the clear ones. It's, like, the white creamy colored ones. And so that just kind of hides a little bit of the metal. And so for those of you who are wondering, like, why my braces look kind of discreet sometimes, that's why. So, um, what else? Have you guys have been asking me about it? Um, my experience with them. Some of you have been asking if it hurts, like how, you know, how's it going? Um, it's really not that bad at all. Maybe, you know, if you're really just not used to it, it'll of course feel really uncomfortable at first. If you're just, you know, if you're about to get braces or you will in the near future. Um, there's really nothing to be afraid of. You just, you'll get accustomed to it a lot faster than you'll think and you'll forget you even have them. So... They're really not that bad. Sometimes, you know, you'll come in for checkups and then they'll like tighten it up or give a thicker metal rim wire, wire through, and it'll they'll tighten it up and you know you might feel some pressure and a little bit of discomfort, but it's it's really not that unbearable. I mean, I know you guys will be able to handle it, so no worries, no fears. Um, braces, I think, are definitely worth it. You know, don't feel bummed out about it. Don't let people tease you about it. It's it's silly, you know, because braces, it's so common to get them. There's no, uh, you know, not everyone has perfect teeth. Not everyone's perfect. I'm far from perfect, as you can see. Oily skin. I've got braces now. Um, you know, it's cool. So <laughs> you just got to be happy in your own skin, I guess. And let's see. What else have you guys asked me about the braces? Um... I think that's pretty much it. Just, you know, you guys are wondering, like, what kind of braces I have and what color bands I wear. So, yeah, I guess that's all I have to say. Um, one last thing is keep on smiling. Don't, you know, don't stop smiling just because you have braces or just because you're about to get them. Keep on smiling. Your smile is still precious and just express yourself and be happy, you know, be happy in your own skin and love yourself. And that's all. All right. It's time for me to get some rest now. I hope you all have a good night or good day or whatever time it is, wherever you are. And thanks so much for tuning in. You all have a great one. Bye.